Okay. I just woke up. I'm gonna put my hair up in a bun. Okay, so today I originally wanted to do a dorm tour and a room tour, but I thought I'd have more time during the end of the year to film this, um, but I don't. Due to the coronavirus, Ryerson residents have to move out on Monday and today is Friday and we got like a five day notice. So two of my roommates already moved out. One of them's moving out today. I haven't even started packing anything. So I'm gonna quickly do a dorm tour and a room tour because I will have no other chance to do it. So that's what we're gonna be doing. And if it's messy, I'm sorry. Okay. Okay, so when you walk in, this is all my roommate's stuff, he's moving out today. So, this is like the living space. We used to have posters all along this wall and this one, but um, my roommate took them down because he wanted to take them back home. Um, and then you turn to the right and here's the kitchen. It's also a mess because obviously everybody's moving out stove, oven, that's our gross dish cleaner, the sink, which I'm not even going to show you guys. And then we just have the storage on the bottom, storage at the top. Yeah, our sink, that's disgusting. And then we have more shelving. This, this was mine originally, and now all I have is my protein powder left. So this whole shelving used to be mine. Um, still have the kettle here these were my plates and everybody else's plates were in here too but of course they're all gone um more shelving down here like big empty storage and then we have this random room that the fridge got put in and then we also put our garbage in here so our garbage recycling you don't really need to see that what's it just regular sized freezer and fridge, everything's empty. And this is from Halloween, so literally, this door literally just closes and you can block this whole thing off. Um, yeah, so then we go back from the kitchen. It's all my roommate's stuff. We had this arranged differently, but we had to set it back to the original state. So we just have one side table here, another side table over there. Um, our living space was just very uncomfortable couches. And then this is our our little table to sit at and eat. Um, and this is our window. This is my view. It's very not eventful. It's literally just this sketchy apartment and an alleyway. Oh, the things we've seen here. Never a dull moment, honestly. Um, so then walking back around. So there's the kitchen down this hall. This is my roommate's room that's still here. This is their half bathroom, and then right over here is my roommate who already moved out room, and that one's just, I won't even show you that. So yeah, half bathroom, I don't know where this came from, one of my roommates were drunk, and then that showed up. So then walking down this hallway, um, to the left we just have this storage space, which it used to be like stacked all the way up to here. But, you know, everybody's moving up, so everybody's taking boxes and stuff. This is our... Oh no, what happened to him? Oh. This was our little balloon that we got on the first day of Frosh Week. Um, and we named him Ness because he looks like a pea. And if you know, you know. So yeah. My friend drew a little face, he had a bow tie and some little legs. He did have a little hat for a while, but now that's gone. Um, so then working down this hallway, this door is literally another entrance to my room. Um, why is this door here? I've got no clue, but yeah. So literally this door opens. Can you enter through it? This is my room number. Can you enter through it? No because we have a flash key instead of an insert key so if we wanted to keep this door open we'd have to lock it 
so it doesn't yeah so we'd always do that when we wanted to go to our neighbors um but yeah this is just the hallway that's the common area so we have two doors um and then this is my room i'll show you guys in a second and this is my other roommate room who is already gone this is the full bathroom um so yeah don't mind the shower curtain it's abs and my outfit is just so great i'm wearing my high school um grad sweatpants and my high school and ready for the light it's been like that all semester so we literally just have the sink it's kind of gross um a mirror that just literally has my stuff in it because nobody else uses this bathroom unless they want to shower garbage toilet and then this is what the shower situation is literally only my stuff and my other roommate that's still here this is his old shower curtains because the other ones that it came with was disgusting so we added these weird little fish curtains so now we're gonna go into my room um here i'll just close the door real quick so this is my room originally what's it oh god 311b but i put our floor president and one of my good friends kevin on my door because why the heck not um so this is my room when you enter it it is a little messy and i'm sorry for that but i literally need to start packing today and i just haven't been um the light does absolutely nothing in this room but i will start the tour so when you open the door i and close the door i just have this welcome sign that my friend made me because i thought it was cute and we have this large mirror on the door the full length of the door so that's great that we don't need to bring an actual mirror of our own um and then i just put my clothes right here like as a closet this was supposed to be my bedside table but i just put it in to put my shoes in my laundry basket recycling and then when you move your way up i have two bins that just have like random stuff in it and then all of my hoodies it goes like all the way back and my friend just helped me put her little twinkle lights on when she moved out um because i did have a roommate before the roommate over here and she did move out but now she's my roommate again at my apartment so yeah um a lot of people put like curtains here but i didn't want to i liked the, how it looked open um and then i have my desk very uneventful um these chairs are so uncomfortable so my mom bought me a cushion but yeah um and then i just have my pens and pencils and little cups and stuff this was my other roommates because he's from kenya and he couldn't take it home with him because he's already gone so he gave it to me um for now um this is my cork board i just put a bunch of photos all over it um my little sister made that one this lady at u of t was sketching and then she made that for me apparently it's me so yeah um this is from my friend who went traveling in europe and she got me that um and then here are just a bunch of my photos from high school with my high school friends and my boyfriend you don't need to see the pda but yeah and then there's a lot of my cat because my cat is absolutely adorable What's it? there he is there he is again um and this is just all my travel stuff right here um this is my grad little photos more grad all of that stuff here's me at grad with my taking a photo with my cat my friend trevor and then these did have large pieces of paper just like going all along with all my classes but now i don't um here is um polaroids that i found at vintage stores and these are just photos that i bought off of a craft fair and this is my bed it would be more nice and neat but i didn't feel like it and half my pillows are already moved out so this is my bed it's a twin xl this is a heated blanket that my mom got me at costco that's my teddy from when i was born my mom got me this little plushy mellow thing if you know they're really soft and literally feel like marshmallows 
Um, these are my school textbooks, my reading textbooks, my laundry stuff, other stuffies that I have, and this is my travel shelf. Um, but yeah, everything else is in the box. I just didn't want to have a lot out. Um, but yeah, and then here's all my water bottles, protein powders, pre-workouts, and all that stuff. And then I just have a garbage here. I have a rug on the ground. This is what you see. And then I'll move on to this wall. This is just my um, towels and hair ties, grocery baskets. I just put hooks so I have my sweater, backpacks, and winter jacket. I have my shoes and this is my gam gambling set that my dad gave me. So I guess we play sometimes, not really. This is what I got at Ikea. It holds all my beauty and hygiene stuff. Um, and then we just have like my dresser, which is literally an absolute mess right now. Um, my water bottle. Oh, my water bottle. And then I just have all of this. I have my diffuser, all my jewelry is in here. And then my Nana got me this plant, which was so sweet of her because she can't see me right now. Um, and then I just have my little posters. Um, my my roommate who moved out, who I'm rooming with now, she painted me this because she didn't like it, and so I took it. This is just a Vancouver Island poster that I got in in Victoria because I missed it. Um, I got this poster at the beginning of the year because I thought it was funny, okay? Um, um, my mom got me this, Plant Lady, because I love plants. Um, I went to go see Role Model, and for those of you who know, um, him, he's absolutely amazing. And then my Kenyan roommate, Kian, he got me this because he loves Obio. So I asked him for a sticker. And then this is just like when I went to St. Martin and then when I went to New Zealand. And this is just what we got um, from residence when we first moved in. That is literally my whole room. It is not eventful at all. Um, my rug, blankets, you know. You don't really need to see in these, but because it's a mess, I try to organize them, but I'm not good at organizing. But yeah, that's basically it. This is my room. I'm gonna miss it a lot, but I'm happy to be moving out. And I'm thankful that I got apartment an apartment when I did before moving out because I didn't think that I was actually gonna move out until school was actually over, but yeah. Stuff. I literally just took everything off the hanger and folded it in half and then I'm gonna do the same and that's like 40 like a big chunk of my closet I'm gonna try to shove all my hoodies in here too but so this is my progress demolish this whole closet into a suitcase my laundry bin and a duffel bag so yeah, my entire closet is empty. My friend's gonna pick me up soon. Gonna drop all this shit off and then do it all over again with this and the drawers under here and this and then I'll take all this shit last and the stuff on my shelves. Taking down all of these. We're getting there. Half my corkboard's gone too. <laughs> All this shit. Oh, Ness. <gasps> the heck? You need to pop for more. Oh! There we go. Oh! Hi, Ness. It's lasted all year. <laughs> Goodbye, baby. Rest in peace. Gotta go in the garbage now. <laughs> Last thing. <laughs> Last two things. And they're great. Awesome. And it's officially, it's officially over. <laughs> Kevin! Maybe Kevin! It's Kevin! Oh, it's not focused. Okay. Just tap it. Now it's officially over. Kevin. So sad. Um, yeah, we have a bunch of stuff. Stocked. Hi. It's all done.
honestly so sad. I might start crying.